icon targeted by a vicious and cruel joke. Ray Maher is one of TV's nice guys, a respected actor and this year's winner of the Gold Logie. But his good name is being dragged through the mud in a series of YouTube videos that have been watched by half a million viewers. We have censored the bad language in this story, but we must tell you the material is still confronting. Oh, stop, mate. Don't f me, boy. I'm not coming home with you. You're f coming home with me, Brighty, right? Yeah, you little. I looked at it and I thought, hit the nutter alert because this guy's a sicko. Rebecca Gibney, eat a d I absolutely flogged you, all right? I really do strongly disapprove of this cowardly, slimy little act. You saw who in the four wheel drive? Curtis! Playing a little mongrel, he saw me. Do. Ray Ma is a man with many personas. There's the timeless Alf Stewart. Attack, Where are you going? I'm going for a walk, woman. No, There's Ray, the stalwart actor, ever on set. Well, I'm not surprised. The bloke's a compulsive liar. And the gold logie legend. Ray Ma. I won a chook raffle. You were picked as the man. Oh, look, I, you know, I honestly thought Rebecca Gibney had won it. I really did. Now he also has a YouTube persona he most certainly did not sign off on. There you go. Gouge your eyes out and burn your off with a blowtorch. I don't think they're funny. I think uh, anybody who would find that amusing would have to have a pretty warped sense of humour. If you're going to have robust free speech, this is the sort of content that has to exist, totally. She seems to be pretty keen on you too, Sancho. The YouTube clips were posted by a user who calls himself Doodleburger. By dubbing a fake voiceover, he has the squeaky clean Ray Ma and his alter ego Alf cast as a foul-mouthed, child-molesting rapist obsessed with a rape dungeon. Are you excited about tonight? Yeah, I'm very excited, mate. Are you? A bit nervous. <laughs> now, I've been hearing a lot of things that you have a rape dungeon. A oh, rape what? A rape oh, dungeon. Oh, yeah, 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 the bloody rape dungeon, mate. Yeah, we're going off about it. They're, they're really liking the idea of the rape dungeon, you know. Um, so when you are doing jokes about rape and, and people being locked in dungeons and, and incest, and it's not on. That crosses the line. Well, it's been alleged that if you don't win the gold logie, you're going to go on a kill spree. Nah, mate, cut off it. I'm a nice guy. <laughs> so you don't have any weapons on you? Yeah, mate. Are you serious? Of course I do. <laughs> nah, look, I'm just pulling your leg, mate. Got no weapons, just a jacket. I'll probably just, you know, stomp with me boots if I have to. In some ways, to Ray, it might be water off a duck's back. Although, I wouldn't like to be the people who had perpetrated this if Ray found him out, because he's, uh, he, he wouldn't like it, and uh, they'd suffer for it. Alf. Judy Nunn played There's Ray Ma's on-screen wife on Home and Away for 12 years. So she spoke to him about the YouTube clips today. So I think he's bewildered by it, but the one thing that I know would anger him, does anger him, as it angers me, and I think any intelligent person, is that anybody who puts this sort of stuff out without their name to it is just, of course, the ultimate coward. I mean, you know, run away and hide. I mean, Pact of the Rafters was on a dead set roll, and I really thought, Rebecca, you were home and hose, but... This is what Raymar actually said while accepting his Gold Logie Award earlier this year. I'm not going to attempt to go through the whole setup. Damn. And this is how the yeah, dubbed version appears. Right. I'd like to thank a small Cambodian boy that I stole from the market last week. He's been a lot of fun, a lot of help. Now, I'd also like to rub it in again to the old Rebecca Gibney. Eat a d I absolutely f flogged you, all right? This is not the first Doodleburger dub. Previous ones inspired Facebook fan pages. I'd also like to thank the people on Facebook who have made fan pages for my rape dungeon. They're promoting rape and it's very exciting. So thanks a lot, guys. This is the result of the, the YouTube and the, the Twitter world. People can sit in their darkened rooms behind a computer and editing bits together and a, a celebrity becomes a very unwilling participant in a pretty sick joke. Entertainment commentator Peter Ford argues celebrities expect to be sent up but thinks this one goes too far. But in the world of YouTube, the laws seem to be a little bit blurred or certainly not enforced. And that's why something like this can get out there. Well, look, in this country we have free speech and it's a pretty important thing. And, you know, there's no right for you not to have content that you don't like existing. Dom Knight is the author of Comrades, but you might know his TV work better. 
He's the co-creator and unseen member of the ABC's The Chaser. Did you watch the clips? I've watched the clips. Do you think they're funny? I think they're pretty funny. I, the thing that I think is clever about them is that the, the way they've timed it perfectly to the video. And so that is, you know, I, it's just more blue than, than funny. Oh, so hard you'll pour out your nose. Oh, Humour, Knight says, is in the eye of the beholder, and the beauty of a free society is you don't have to like it. So Doodle Burger, or whatever his name is, he's, he's got his mates he's sending this stuff to. It's found an audience. A lot of people have clicked on it and like it. So the audience decides that they like it. That's fine, and no-one else is forced to, to, to watch it at all. People should be free to choose um, what they view and see on the internet, within reason, of course. IT and internet lawyer Eric Karabardak says Doodleburger hasn't broken any laws. Now you play by the rules if you're with my daughter. In fact, Australian law has special protections for people using TV content for the purpose of parody. Is it defamation? Um, look, I don't, uh, on, uh, again, on limited facts and, and, and the video I've seen, I don't believe it's defamatory, uh, simply because of the context in which it was in. Is Ray Maher, he's a nice fella. Amazing man. Yeah. ACA's Brady Halls caught up with some of the home and away cast and crew this afternoon. He's a top bloke. Yeah. It's hard to believe he is that good bloke. Is that yeah. That he is. Ray Maher declined to comment personally about the clips, but. He said, Look, Jude, if you want to go for it and be my spokesperson to family, go for it. This, this is a sort of cowardly, slimy behaviour that certainly Ray doesn't deserve, and uh, uh, nobody does. Right it... On his web page, Doodleburger, whoever he is, describes himself as an amateur comedian. His profile picture? It's a mugshot of the Austrian Josef Fritzl, who molested his children in a dungeon. They would probably defend it by saying, we're only having a laugh. That's not such a laugh for Ray Ma. <laughs> And since we started investigating this story, several, but not all, of the offensive videos have been removed by YouTube, citing copyright infringement. Well, they're the most precious stones on earth.